It started out innocent enough, a police officer checking on a driver stuck in the sand dunes while off-roading. It ended in chaos with a foot chase across I-25 and a shootout. Here's News 13's Brittany Bade with the video. He's got a gun! A foot chase across I-25 in Los Lunas. At this time, we don't know where he's at. He's still crawling on his belly somewhere. Followed by a high-risk game of hide-and-seek in the sand dunes. Okay, the suspect is crawling. He's hit. He keeps pointing his arms at us like he's still armed, though. Just 10 minutes earlier, at around 8 a.m. on a cold January morning, Los Lunas police pulled up to the SUV neighbors had reported for off-roading on private property. What were you doing over here, man? You're not supposed to be over here. Oh, oh, I didn't know that. I was just messing around. The driver, later identified as Jerry Yelch, got his girlfriend's Ford Expedition stuck in the sand. You have four-wheel drive? No. The officer thought something was off. Just a question, brother. Why, why were you out here so early? Just messing around. The officer asks for Yelch's driver's license, which he said he does not have and admits may not be valid anyway. Is it legit? Uh, no. Okay, how come? Uh, probably because I have a warrant. For what? Uh, That's it? Yeah. No other take no other warrants, Not nothing like that. Of, no. But Yauch likely already knew that he did have another warrant for a felony, a road rage incident in August, where police say he pointed a gun at a mom and her 15-year-old child who has special needs. The officer quickly learned Yauch was lying. Okay, Jerry, do me a favor, step out real quick, brother. Not... Come on. Well, well, you guys gonna have to kill me then. Yelch barricades himself inside. Break his window. And one officer sees him reach into the back seat. Take cover, take cover. The officers know the SUV can't go anywhere, but Yelch soon decides to flee on foot. He's getting out. Officers say Yelch turned around and fired at least one shot at them, and three officers returned fire. <laughs> Yelch was hit in the leg and goes down. Officers put him in handcuffs and help stop the bleeding until paramedics arrived. It's going to hurt, man, but we're, we're trying to get you some help here, okay? Brittany Bade, KRQE News 13. Yelch has a long criminal history, including arrests for child abuse, aggravated assault, and drugs.